hello and welcome back to the mullet boys youtube channel and uh i'm gonna be showing you how to drive a 1486 international now this one's like uh 43 to 45 years old it was made in the 70s and uh i'm gonna start you off with starting it and i'll some people might know how to do this, others may not. But here's a important thing to know. You gotta push this lever from off, up past this notch, and this is your throttle. And you turn this key, the battery comes on. Then on comes the engine. <clears throat> and moving it's pretty simple. You just gotta, you have a total of eight gears. High, one through four, low, one through four. Well, then I guess you got reverse neutral. The interesting about the thing about this tractor is you don't have to put the clutch in the shift into neutral. You can actually shift it into neutral and park without pressing the clutch in. And it has two brakes. This one is for the, uh, let's see, that's the, this is the left. The left brake goes to the left wheel right brake goes to the right wheel and that's to help you with stir turning and muddy areas and this little flap here is an option to lock the brakes so uh oh and here's the lights you switch that so you press the clutch in all the way in pull that lever out you put it in whatever gear now these sometimes tend to shift oddly Is you can't stop just pressing the brakes. You gotta press the clutch in to stop. So you just like this, press the brakes in. Oh, again. So moving that up will rev the engine up and give you more power and speed if you're driving. Or maybe a few other things I should tell you here. So that there is the ether, and if it's pulled out, that can help you start. Horn. Here's a lighter. These are old. I actually charge my phone in that if I needed to. It turns signals and so at 710 RPM right now. That's the exact gas exhaust temp. PTO. Miles per hour. This. I don't know what this is. It's something with torque. And that's all I know. This is the PTO obviously and uh here's your hydraulics and these there's a bracket thingy on the back uh, i don't know what it's called uh let me think i don't know what it's called those control that i think and you got all these gauges which sometimes don't work and yeah pretty sure that's it you have uh, some controls for heat, windshield wiper, a radio. That one does not work. So, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thanks for watching. I hope somebody found this useful. And yeah, I encourage you to check out our Instagram. I'll leave a link in the bio. 